hello strangers welcome back at last to a video now just quickly showing you here the glitters that i'll be using i didn't actually use the second one but i just want to apologize in advance this video is shite <laughs> i've got most of it in that i needed to but i just like literally i haven't done one in so long I just, it was so hard to keep myself in shot so i apologize here so I'm just coming in on this middle finger with some, these little like rosy coloured bronzy love hearts are from um, the Autumn Sweetheart collection from the Glitter Fairy. It is a mix of other bits as well but I just picked out the hearts and then, um, so I've just... I've just basically wet it with a bit of a bit of clear as always using CJP that's so beautiful holographic and then I'll come over the top of that from the cuticle and just blend down with some of that rose gold fine from Lacente. this feels so weird record like doing a voiceover because before um I used a video camera and We'd use the laptop and then I'd have a mic to do my voiceover. But now I've got a phone. So, yeah, I'm just trying to find my bearings with the phone. Sorry. Just mouthing at my child to get out. <laughs> um, I'm just trying to find my bearings with the phone. And, you know, it's not, it's not too bad, but um, it could be better. So I've just added some hearts in a row on my thumb there and I I missed out recording on quite a bit of it as well so sorry about that. So I just did the same, placed some clear, placed some of the hearts across the centre and then I've just capped it and I'm going to do a bit of a geometric design with that. On this ring finger I'm going to add some crystals so I'm just doing a full nail of um birthday suit on there like this little recording uh editing app is so weird i'm i'm like so old i don't know how to bloody do anything <laughs> so yeah index i missed that out as well that's just a full uh, finger of birthday suit because i'm going to come in with some pigment on that afterwards as well now on this pinky, I'm coming in with the um, rose gold from the Sente and then over the top, I'm picking up a whole bead of the um, Autumn Sweethearts collection from the Glitter Fairy. So it's got all the hearts in, but it's got like little iridescent um, hexes and, excuse me, things in there as well. I'm just nudging that around. Oh my god, I feel so nervous. I feel like a my first day at school. This is so weird. I'm so sorry. This video is really shocking as well. I'm really sorry. But yeah, new camera angle as well, which a lot of people have been asking for. So it was just getting my camera at the right angle. And I think because I was doing my own... Um, Oh, it was too far forward for me but I couldn't have it any further away otherwise um, I don't even know what I'm saying yeah I basically would have been sitting on top of the light so hopefully it'll be easier when I have some clients in so I'm going to record a set tomorrow night and hopefully that goes well so I'm just capping these glitter nails now so obviously birthday suit is well not obviously but birthday suit is a core powder so it doesn't need capping um and i did already sculpt out a, a thin clear base before i started to record anyway so i'm just coming in to just um refine these lines on this little geometric bit I don't know, it looks like I'm being really vigorous, but I'm not. It's because I've sped it up a bit. 
Honestly, I wasn't burning myself. So I'm just going to come in and I'm going to fill the bottom part with a bead of birthday suit. So as I always do, just get a nice, nice size bead, place it on, tuck it in that cuticle as neat as I can get it. And it doesn't matter if you go over the top of that clear because you're going to fall through that anyway. And then the top half, I'm going to sort of do a little glitter fade. So from the line and then fade it down a bit. So we've got like a glass tip. Once I've done that, I'm going to cap that as well, so we don't want to file through that glitter. So yeah, how have you all been? It's been a long time. I hope you've all been well. We've had so much going on. Um, yeah, it's just been mental. Like we just found out my little, my eldest son has ADHD and he's just had a test for autism as well, so... Um, an ASD or you know, it's all just so complicated and then we've had Christmas and everything else so yeah so anyway I completely skipped out putting that stunning chrome which is um, a holographic rose gold from Glitter Planet UK and um, I popped that on and now I'm just popping some crystals on I think I've already put the, yeah I've already put the crystals on and just adding some of these little caviabies. So I've just got a really small brush and I'm dipping into my top coat and I'm just painting on the nail and then I'm picking those beads up with the with the brush and then just putting them where I want them or trying to put them where I want them. So sorry, you missed the best part of the top coat as well. How annoying. Like, literally worst video uploaded today, Soz. But yeah, like I said, hopefully it'll be much easier on a client because I won't be sort of leaning forward trying to check through the camera where my hand is. It should be in the right position anyway. Oh, they look pretty. So yeah, this is the end. I've just left you a little clip of me showing you the finished nails. So sorry for the really short video. Um, I really hope you're well and fingers crossed my video, next video will be better and you'll be able to actually see what I'm doing. Thank you so much for watching and waiting for me and all your lovely messages and I'll speak to you soon. Bye.